What's going on YouTube? Delta Tech here today, and today I'm going to be giving my final predictions and a breakdown of the iPhone 5. Now we're hoping to have a dual core A5 1.2 GHz processor. Uh, so as you can see, this is just a photoshopped uh, picture uh, that I've uh, found on uh, Google Images. The next thing uh, we're hoping to see is hopefully a bigger screen, because there's a lot of uh, smartphones nowadays, such as the HTC Desire, I, I think, and the Samsung Captivate, I think that it is. Um, that have quite big screens, that are about 4.5 inches, so uh, a 4 inch would probably be a really good size to compete with the other sizes. As for the display, uh, we've currently got the IPS, we might be seeing a Super PLS, which uh, might be a, a, a possibility that may occur in the next generation of iPhone. Um, as for design point of view I don't think it'll be very very different although there might be something it might be slimmer I'm sure they're definitely gonna check uh, what's going on with the antenna although it is a good idea they might use a different material or something uh, different just to adjust what happened uh, as you know last year as for the camera they might have a 720p video enhancement rather than I don't think 1080p would be um, you know a possibility in the iPhone 5 although the iPhone 6 may have that um, I wouldn't want to go on to the future about talking about the iPhone 6, but let's stay back to the iPhone 5. Uh, personally, I would like to see something like a micro SD slot, which would be quite good because that means uh, you could expand your memory. So if you bought a 16 gig iPhone 4, as iPhone 5 will be, and uh, you had lot, you filled it up with lots of things, but then you wanted to put, add, add extra movies, applications, videos. I'm sure the uh, micro SD slot would be really good, especially maybe if you wanted to connect it to, uh, sorry, to store your photos on, which would be quite good because then you wouldn't have to have iTunes on every computer that you want to sync the computer to. Uh, that's really it uh, from Top of Tech today. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll catch you later. Uh, well. I haven't actually finished the video, but um, I'm actually running out of video ideas, but uh, hom hoping to put some green screen videos after this one. I've just been playing around with a shower curtain, a green shower curtain, which works very well. Uh, I got that from Ikea for about $3. You can get about three of them for $9, so <laughs> you should really check out Ikea, a good place to be. So uh, yeah, that's from Top Tech, don't forget to screen, and I'll catch you later.